Nick, inside this building comes a plan to care, study, and keep a record of Guam's cultural artifacts unearthed over the years. But what should be the military's effort to preserve cultural resources, at least here in the Guam Cultural Repository at the University of Guam in Mangilao, is getting a lot of pushback from locals, specifically from local activist group Pratei Le Texan. Members taking this opportunity to be here during the Jordan Region Marianas open house and processing the military's actions. Both sides weighing in on today's planned event. So that's why having a facility that's built to these standards is so super important. And so you'll see that as you go in there, like, wow, this wall looks funny. Why? Because it's it's specially made. Well, why are all these pipes with these nozzles? Well, that's because it's a suppression system to ensure if something happens, the fire can be you know, taken out very quickly and we can preserve uh, the history that's going to be stored in this building. It's absolutely fantastic. Uh, again, it will look like just a big empty room, but kind of pay attention to some of those details. Please take the time to talk to our, our archaeologists. They're happy to talk to you. Um, I will admit, uh, they are, uh, are much smarter on a lot of these subjects than I am. And uh, so uh, if they say some terms or something you're not familiar with, just ask them to kind of explain it. Uh, because sometimes I get talking to them and I say, well, you have to slow that down. And, and then... We're sending a clear message that we want no more destruction. We want no more desecration. That these remains, these ancestral sacred objects um, that our ancestors once held and touched and are evidence of their lives here in our homelands, that these belong to the people of Guam not Joint Region Marianas and not the Department of Defense. And so for them to use this building as a bargaining chip for the destruction, for the desecration, for the contamination is unacceptable. So thank you all so much for being here and sign them off to Dakota and, and Jeremy for leading us, for grounding us and uh, sign them off to everybody. Nalotla! Nalotla! We caught up with Governor Lou Leon Guerrero earlier today who said she doesn't feel there's any conflict as the DOD is the entity that funded the cultural repository. But these activists don't want the military handling the cultural artifacts, saying the Chamorro people are the rightful stewards. So the military says they're taking this responsibility to preserve Guam's cultural resources very seriously. Mitsuki Hirayama, KUAM News.